Hey friends, so I love a good story. I love a God story. I'm not a storyteller, but you know what it's like when somebody starts telling a good story. Well, I have a good testimony for you today that will encourage you and maybe blow your mind like it did me. Okay, so a couple weeks ago, I was sitting on the couch with my oldest son, Nathan. He's 17, he was kind of gloomy. I was like, what's wrong, son, what's going on? He was like, mom, the world is going to hell in a handbasket. <laughs> I was like, yeah, yeah, I can sure, sure look like that at times. And um, some time passed, a couple, that time, couple days passed, and he had a lot more pep in his step, and he came to me, and he was like, mom, you know how I was talking to you the other day? Well, I was talking, and I was praying to God about how the world is going to hell in a handbasket, and you know what he said? He said, I created you so it wouldn't. Oh my gosh. That is a fantastic word. I am blown away by that word. And it's not just for him. It's for all of us. This world can look crazy. Media is in our face all the time. It's not really hard to see the good in it sometimes. And it looks like we are on a sinking ship really quickly. But that's just a reminder to you, to him, to all of us, that we matter. Our prayers, our efforts to stay kind to people, to forgive people, to love people, really is our lifesaver, really is the world's lifesaver. So I hope this encourages you that it was a great message for Nathan, and I hope he remembers that for the rest of his life. But it's also a great message for us that this world looks like it's going down real quick, but he created you so it wouldn't.